Lisa Pritchard and I'm Carol Miller and we're both instructors with the Modern Horse here in Cheshire. Our little series of top tips is to help you as a rider overcome those annoying habits that no matter how hard you try you don't seem to be able to get rid of. We hope you enjoy them. Okay, right. What happens when you've got short arms? I'm five foot nothing, I've actually got extremely short arms and short legs. Now on Rocky, it's fine because he's just a nice size and he's nice and round. Most of us are not blessed with horses that are this perfect. So what happens when we've got short arms and we have our riding instruction, patch riding horses, 16, 17 pounds, all blood sort, our, our instructor will say to us quite naturally, keep your hands down. Now just watch what happens to a short armed rider when she pushes her hands down. Okay? So that's what happens. I've got my hands down now where the instructor holds them. You can see my tail is coming out behind me. I'm actually sitting really heavily on the front of my pelvis on my fork. And I'm going to tip forward, the heels are coming back, all the rest of my chest is closed. So the instructor then sees that and says, sit up Lisa. So Lisa then tries to sit up, but then the reins get too long. And then the instructor says, shorten your reins Lisa. So we're back to doing that again, or then we're doing that. And we end up contorted and bouncing and pulling and doing all sorts of things. Simply because our darling instructor has not realised that their arms are short. So we can't have our hands down here. It's really, really important when we ride that it's the frame, the posture of the rider is as correct as possible. Now for me, riding a big horse with short arms, there will be a gap between the wither and my hand. There will still be a straight line from the bit to my elbow, and my elbow will be elastic, which is what we're after. But my hand will be a little bit higher. Now, anybody who is watching this, I hope that you won't be looking at it thinking, well, Lisa's hands are really too high. My hands were up here somewhere all the time. They would be too high. But it's the straight arm. It looks good, it feels good, and the horse likes it. So the short arm riders, please concentrate on the straight line from the horse's bit all the way through to your elbow. And don't really worry about the gap between the horse's wither and where your hand starts.